two years and counting, a Jones County mom is still seeking closure after someone shot and killed her son in 2017. Three people have been charged with his death. No one has yet to be tried. Today, Chelsea Beinfort sat down with the mom on the anniversary of her son's murder. He had a beautiful smile. Sherry Green flips through old photos of her son, Marquise Hardwick. That was Mother's Day. We had went out to eat. The last Mother's Day she ever spent with him. Green says two years ago, her son was ambushed by gunfire, gunned down inside his own Northside Villas apartment on Eatonton Highway. That's the day our lives got all turned upside down. Police charged three men with felony murder, Cameron Banks, Justerius Canty, and Jaqueline Clark. He grew up with all three of these boys, and they were friends at one time, you know, and then all of a sudden it just went south. Three days later, investigators charged three more people with hindering Clark's arrest. I used to see people on TV and, you know, they talk about their kids, the laws, and my heart went out to them, but it's like I never really understood it until it happened to me. According to Okmulgee Circuit District Attorney Stephen Bradley, the three suspects charged with Hardwick's murder are in jail, but Green says that's not enough. Because I don't feel like he's resting in peace until this is resolved. And then none of us can rest in peace until it's resolved because we still got these three that we've got to go to court with. Green says two years is too long and she hopes justice will be served soon. In Gray, Chelsea Vine for 13 WMAZ News. Stephen Bradley says he plans to prosecute all three suspects at the same trial. He expects they will be tried early next year.